Damn, Aiden, you a killer. For you guys who know Michael Reeves and Mark Rober is, you know what I'm talking about. For you who don't know who they are, I guess it's a good thing that I made this video, huh? Let's talk about Mark Rober first. Mark Braxton Rober was born March 11, 1980, so his current age now is 40. Wait, what? This guy? Damn, Mark, why not start posting about that potion of youth you made? The about page of his channel says that he studied mechanical engineer. So, just like me. <laughs> He worked for NASA JPL for 9 years. For 7 of which he was working on the Curiosity rover. You know, the one that they live in the planet called Mars. Maybe they should name the next one Curiosity rover. <laughs> he posted his first video 9 years ago about his Halloween costume with the iPad on it. Now, this guy is making big experiments and big inventions and posting it on YouTube. And he now has over 14 million subscribers on the platform. This is me in the middle of a shark feeding frenzy in that cage, which as it happens, doesn't actually keep the sharks out. This is a new and improved custom built bait package that is recording him on four different cameras that just released a pound of the world's finest glitter along with some other nasty surprises. <laughs> This is me reclaiming my title for the world's largest and tallest elephant toothpaste experiment. Now, let's talk about Michael Reeves, aka Crackhead. Michael Reeves' current age is 22. Just a two years different from my age, maybe I should have posted something on YouTube years ago. He was born November 20, 1997. His father is likely an American descent. What? Likely? <laughs> What the fuck? While his mother is a Filipino descent. Uy, kababayan! Prior to his YouTube career, Michael Reeves struggled academically in high school. Who the heck write this? Wait, let's continue reading. To a point where he realized that he needed to be able to do something in order to not to start. So, instead of improving his grade, he turned to learning how to code to the ire of his parents and guidance counselors. Ha! School is for a nerd. Am I right, Michael Reeves? They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Come on, back me up here. But to sum it all up, he uploaded in YouTube three years ago the robot that shines a laser in your eye. Well, that's just dumb, but at the same time, a fucking genius? I mean, who in their right mind would make such a thing? But he still made one. And that video explode in YouTube, giving him a large amount of views and sub with just one video. And now this guy is making big experiments and big inventions and posting it to YouTube. And he now has over 5.4 million sub on the platform. Amazon wants me to build like a baby doll toy that shoots lasers out of its eyes because there's a scene from season one of the boys where Butcher picks a baby superhero out of the crib and uses its laser eyes to fucking cut two people in half. It's badass. We can build a better surgery robot for a lot less. Come on. The biggest flaw in Da Vinci's design is that it relies on these clunky, slow robotic arms for movement. Say you're operating on a patient's foot. He starts screaming out in pain. You gotta get up to his face, smack him around a little bit, make him shut up. Good fucking luck with these robotic arms. They're slow as shit and they don't have any travel distance. Last time I took your robot ideas and I actually built them. Not because they were good, but because they were so excruciatingly bad that I wanted to show you they were bad and cyberbully you so hard that no one else would ever want to post a robot idea on my video again so what's the difference between these two guys content that's for you guys to know when you check their channel but before you leave why not leave a like and subscribe and also comment down below who should I compare next